what's going on y'all welcome back to the garage and welcome to the last video of the year so happy new year 2024 to you and yours yeah so um i haven't been on here for a while a lot of things going on I'll give you an update on my daughter um two days after christmas she did go into surgery uh to have a cyst removed uh on her lady parts and um i was told in the beginning it was five and when we got there the Surgeon said, no, it's 10. It's quite large. Uh, to give you an idea, that's the size of a baby's head. And I'm like, oh, no one told me this. And she said, well, they were going by what the ultrasound is. We went a different direction, so we know what we're dealing with. By the end of it, all said and done, it was 15 centimeters, which is quite large. Uh, took a little bit longer than they anticipated. It went way past the two-hour operating window. But my kid has amazing healing powers. And yesterday I came home, it was like she hadn't had anything done. Back to normal, moving around, joking, laughing, just back to her regular self. She's got them dadgum Wolverine healing abilities, man. She's a mutant, <laughs> which is great because, yeah, I stressed myself out. I think I got about four or five more gray whiskers in my beard. Nah, anyway, she's great, y'all. She's at the friend right up the road. Uh, we didn't celebrate the new year. So I wish the new year has all the best to come to you absolutely so what we're looking at here is a giant pink bag full of loose cars from my mama when i went down for christmas day uh she hooked me up y'all <laughs> just like she always does and so there's loose cars in here there's a couple that are carded and i said you know what i just kind of took a quick peek through and i said let's play a game together called keeper or stinker <laughs> so let's go ahead and move this humongous freaking heavy ass bag and I did say big bag and let's play a game called keeper or stinker <laughs> and let's see if y'all can guess which one is going through my head so right off the bat these are these cards are trashed <laughs> super trashed but it is a twin meal yeah so Batman versus Superman so definitely a keeper definitely a keeper I like the muscle tone it's actually quite nice. Well, we'll be opening up those here in a second. But let's get on to the Lucy's. All right, let's turn this on. Try to run to these as quickly as possible. And right off the bat, first one out of the bag. Surprise, surprise. Uh, it is a stinker. <laughs> Absolutely a stinker. Throw it out on that side. Uh, yeah, okay. Definitely a keeper. It needs a little work. It's not in best shape. Oh, wheels are all... You know what, though? Hey, it's got potential. Definitely a keeper. Definitely a keeper. Sorry. God dang it. There ain't enough room on this dang table. All right. Next one up. Hmm. Torque Twister. Hmm. Ugh. You know what? Let's make this category over here stinker and tinker. Uh, because uh, I see some potential for Gaslands there. So that's definitely a stinker, but we're going to keep it. Ooh. Ooh. Let's get on up in here. Definitely a keeper. Um, I actually do have one of these. It's, there was a regular pocket ride for a while. You see my Instagram when I'm traveling. I actually put this on the windowsill. You know? Heck yeah. Definitely a keeper. Now we gotta move through these pretty fast, y'all. There's a bunch. Oh, okay. Okay, old Bronco. Wheels are kind of jacked up, but you know what? That's that's definitely a keeper. I can do something with that. Let's see what this is. Oh, Porsche 911 Carrera 4S. Uh, definitely a Maestro in it. Yeah, cheese and crackers. I'm going stinker on that one. <laughs> I may move it later, but for right now, ooh, this is cool. The Super Tsunami, man. I think that's pretty stinking cool. That's definitely got a chance at a restoration, customization. Uh, uh, we'll put in the stinker pile just to tinker with it later on. Oh, cheese and crackers, look at that. Uh, that guy had a rough race. It's missing the missing the tail fin, missing the dead gum mirrors on the side, but it is a vet. 
and it is chunky so we're gonna throw that over here in the tinker side we'll, we'll play around with that one later on Ooh. now I do know I do have a couple of these and uh, I don't think I have a white one I know I have a Zamac yep okay that's a keeper all right what else we got Ooh, this is cool Ooh. I don't recall seeing this one before the embosser I don't know what that's about that's pretty stinking cool though we couldn't use another car transport all right keeper all right moving on Ooh, ooh, the road bandit yeah what do y'all think stinker or keeper yeah it's a keeper <laughs> surprise uh, jeepneys are like one of my favorite things believe it or not I've never been to the Philippines and I do have a couple of these in my collection uh, they were made from World War II surplus jeeps that the US military left behind after the war after World War II and they were put to use usually they seat about 16 people two straight benches on either side this is civil transportation in the Philippines and they're facing uh, last couple years since the pandemic they're trying to get these off the road. They're saying they use too much fuel. That they, uh, a 52 passenger bus uses as much fuel as one of these for 16 people. I'm trying to run these guys out of business. And that's not cool. So, yeah, definitely a keeper. Yeah. Look it up. Look it up. Google it. Jeepney, Philippines. And see what happens. The Astano Hato. I like this car. I've done several uh, customs on this one. I don't have a white one, though. But that's okay. That's definitely going to be a keeper future future custom or something okay I don't think I have this color of this Mustang uh, definitely a keeper but it also may be stripped out because these wheels need to be done uh, we'll throw it on this side for right now seems like the keeper and stinkers are about the same oh I don't know what that is but that's pretty cool front end almost looks like a Pantera pretty cool Pretty roach though, so definitely a stinker. I might find something to do with that later on. What's this? What's this? The off duty. Uh, I do have a couple of these. Potential gas lands. We'll throw that in the tinker pile. All right. Oh my god, this thing is hideous. It's 2001 Dodge Super 8 Hemi Concept. Now that is a stinker, y'all. <laughs> no guessing. This is a stinker. Cheese and crackers, Maisto. Uh, wow. And it's got a sunroof. Uh, definitely a stinker. Going over there. Oh, this is nice. Yeah. What is that? Z06 Corvette R Racing. Definitely got a chance to be tinkered with. We'll put that right over here. And reaching in. Oh, also a Maisto. 2014 Corvette Stingray. That is not a bad looking casting for a Maestro, y'all. And it does got a little bit of weight to it. That keeper, 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 keeper. Oh, what's in this bag? Ooh, the Fast Feline. I like this casting. In fact, they just reissued it again. Not my favorite color with the purple wheel or with the purple. The purple's nice, but not the yellow wheels. I might tinker with that one. Throw that right there. What else is coming out? Uh, is this an Oldsmobile Aurora? I think it is. I don't know if I'm wrong, y'all let me know. Definitely could use some love. It looks like it might have been a color shift at one time. I'll throw that over there in that tinker pile. Oh, this is Ferrari. Ferrari 333 SP. Um, I don't have anything like this. Open air racer. Like a cannon type. Yeah, keeper. Throw that over there in the keeper pile. What else we got now? Ah, <laughs> so I posted a picture on Instagram, and uh, good old Dom over at Superbird Diecast goes, "Hey, that purple dinosaur at the very bottom is a treasure hunt." I'm like looking at the picture again. I how in it? He just saw that tail sticking out, and you can tell where there was a treasure hunt symbol there at one time. Stinker. <laughs> uh, uh, what was that? Is that like a Ferrari type deal? Uh, yeah, definitely a stinker, man. I uh, don't know. Gaslands background kind of thing. Oh, that's a nice truck. I um, actually do have one of these that I will swap. This one definitely needs a wheel swap. Yeah, keeper. We'll figure out something with that one. Ah, tarantula. 
Yep, stinker. <laughs> Most of those stinkers will go to my nephew, man, for when he comes down. Ooh. Wheels are all kind of jacked up, but it is a Golf, and it is an Indy car, so... Yep, definitely a keeper. I'll just have to fix those wheels. <laughs> they... Hey, it was played hard with. But that's cool, though. That's what they're made for, man. All right, reaching in the bag. All right. Is this a Roger Dodger 2.0? Yes, it is. Yep. Ah, stinker. That'll go to my nephew. He'll, he'll enjoy that. Ah, uh, this one. Ah. Don't know what it is. Stinker. <laughs> he'll have fun with that. Oh, this is sad. Yeah, you know, Lamborghini Veneno. Uh, definitely, it's going to be a keeper, but it's going to be in the tinker pile. Maybe we flat black out that sucker, make, made it, make a Batmobile or something out of that. That'd be cool. It looks like a Batmobile. Oh, okay. Uh, I do have a couple of these in my collection. In fact, one of the first customs I ever did was on this Mustang. So, uh, definitely going to go in the keeper because I don't have that color. Definitely a keeper. Oh, all right. That one says Gamora on there. Uh, definitely a stinker. Yeah, yeah. Ugh. I can smell it from here. Ooh, now this one. Well played with, but heavy. Metal base, metal top. Hot Wheels racing livery. Not in the world's greatest shape, but not in the world's worst. Definitely be a keeper. We do have a couple of things in racing livery like that that I can put together in the grouping. Ah. Good old McDonald's toy. You know, it's actually not a bad casting. I actually have another one right over here on the ground. It, it could be it could be another Batmobile. I see Batmobiles in a lot of things. I don't know what to tell you. I may send that out to Santa Slow Dog. He can build him a Batmobile from it. Uh, this one's pretty cool. I want to say this one's called the Iridium. I have a couple of these. They're not, it's, it's a neat futuristic concept. Definitely going to go in the Tinker Pile, man. I might make that a hover car or something. I could see that. I could see that. Oh, look at that. Another Moon Eyes. This one looks in a little bit better shape. Not by much. That gun wheels are all jacked up on that one, too. Well, definitely a keeper. Definitely a keeper. We're almost out, y'all. Okay, what do you think, y'all? Keeper or stinker? <laughs> a stinker, man. That's a stinker if i ever seen one. Uh, okay. Maybe I could use some of the engines out of there or something, but it is definitely going to be in the tinker pile. You don't even want to roll. I'll be spending a lot of time in the bathtub. And this one's pretty neat looking. I don't know. Not really my cup of tea, but it might be my nephew's. Throw that down there into the stinker pile. Oh, God. Oh, cheese and crackers. Yeah. Uh, that used to be chrome at one time. And it has been well played with and well off. You know what? Nephew will like it. Now this one, I do have a couple of these. And I have found, y'all, I have found a lot of these just laying around the floors at Walmart. And every one of them, the back wheels are all bent. This, this is just like a really poor design or the axles are too long or something. But every hopper fin I've ever found in the wild, on the ground, has been just just like that but it's a sweet looking ride so definitely gonna go in the tinker pile man definitely gonna go in the tinker pile all right we're getting down to the last nitty-gritty we're getting too long as it is oh all right surf crate yep surf crate definitely cool little play one but you know what it's got potential we'll keep that one and this one believe it or not i do not own one of these just one of those castings, you know, that just didn't appeal to me. And, uh, but I did see something cool. I want to say Junior over on Instagram. This back part is all metal and the posts run straight to the car. And so you can take a Volkswagen, drill a hole through it. And now you've got a camper that matches the Volkswagen. Yeah, just an idea, y'all. So definitely going to go in the Tinker Pile. Uh, looks like another McDonald's stinking car. Yeah, definitely going to be in for the nephew over there. We'll put that in the stinker pile. This one, I want to say this is an Iron Man fantasy. I can see a gas lens out of this. Yep, it's got some neat 
accents, neat features. It's got a fin, so I'm in. Yeah. Tinker Pile. Tinker Pile. This one. I think we just got one of these the other day in the box. Different color. Um, this one is actually the whistle. You can blow through that back end. Make the whirring turbine sound. Pretty cool, man. Futuristic looking. Could be a future gas lens. Could be a future hover car or fighter. Definitely Tinker Pile. Tinker Pile is getting big, y'all. X Racer. Hmm. Definitely a stinker. That'll go to the nephew. He's a stinker too. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, I don't know what this is. I don't even know if there's a name on there. Motor Max. Yeah. Don't see too many Motor Max brands around. Wheels are kind of cool though. Might steal the wheels. I don't know. Future gas lanes. Who knows? Ah. Uh, Ford Torino Talladega. One of the first customs I did. In fact, the first custom I ever did was one of these. It was beat all to heck. From uh, my kids' old play days. First custom I ever did was one of those. Still hanging on the wall. Yeah. Awesome, man. All right. Down to the last two. And uh, I'm going to say this one is a keeper. Ferrari F40. Opening rear end. Super good condition. Definitely going to be a keeper. Let that roll around for a second. And quit. Keeper. Put that right over there. And then the last Lucy that I've got is this sweet 70 Chevelle delivery wagon. Batman Riddler kind of livery. Not a fan of that. I like the purple. I like the red line wheels. Pretty stinking nice, man. Thank you, mama. I love it. Love it. Love it. All right. So keeper pile is not as big as a stinker pile that's for sure kind of zoom back out of here and then the last thing she gave me and i do collect these is these uh tow and go maisto sets man and i wish walmart still carried them 2006 dodge magnum road and track with a camper trailer box is kind of roached but that's okay let's just go ahead and open it up and take a real quick look take a look at the trailer first I think whoever had this had it uh had it open and displayed because it was kind of dirty kind of dusty on the windows i tried wiping them down while i was at her house didn't do too good of a job but the trailer is stinking nice and the wheels do match uh on this dodge magnum and i am a dodge magnum fan you put a hemi in a wagon i'm in son <laughs> you put a hemi in a wagon and i am in Go ahead and put this on there. Let those things run around for a second. Anyway, y'all, that's pretty much. Oh no, shoot! You know what? We'll go ahead and let's just keep this back here. Or we can look at it. Put these right back there, and let's go ahead and open up these trashed out cards, man. Card art was fantastic, but I don't know, man. It was in a storage unit for Lord knows how many years. What year was this? 2015, so that would have been 2016 release date. Ah, let him breathe. We're not going to collect dirty cardboard, man. Because the car is in pristine condition. I do like this casting. This is a really cool casting. I don't know what's going on. Huh, right there. It is a really cool casting. It's a fantasy car, but you know what? In the end... It's really, really nice. Let's go ahead and open up this twin mill. Because uh, this one's actually really stinking cool. That's definitely a keeper right there. Uh, I'm not a Superman fan, but I am a Batman fan. This is actually pretty dang sweet. Looks like Superman's suit right there. A little mix of Batman and Superman. Pretty stinking cool, man. Can't go wrong with a twin mill. Sure can't. Anyway, y'all, that's it. That's uh, the big bag of goodies for my mama at christmas day and man happy to have them got a lot of stuff we can tinker with a lot of stuff we can have fun with and uh yeah so i hope the new year's treats you well hope you find what you want in 2024 and i hope that you are all blessed beyond measure over and over so anyway y'all that's all i got thanks for stopping by the garage on the last day of the 2023 and uh i wish you all the best as always be safe be well and be kind. Always be kind. Until the next time you're at the garage, I'll see you later, grease monkeys.